Cause the accuser's mom I got so angry my eyes were like pools of B.Lude. The mother of the woman at the center of Bill Cosby's sex assault retrial took the stand Monday detailing her graphic call with the accused predator and an anger so intense it made her eyes bleed. Gianna Constant, who testified during Cosby's first trial on the same charges, brought new emotion to the courtroom as she rehashed her disturbing communications with the TV pioneer. The distraught mom immediately called to confront Cosby, now 80, after her daughter, Andrea Constant told her she'd been drugged and molested by him in January 2004. When I was talking to him my anger was so fierce, I had broken capillaries in my eyes and my eyes were like two pools of blood, Constant, who traveled from Ontario, Canada to testify, said of the January 2005 phone call. He said, I feel like I was a dirty old perverted man. And just before the end of the conversation he admitted to me that he was a sick man. I said to him only a sick man would do that. And he said he was a sick man, and it took Andrea to stop him, the feisty mom testified. Those were his last words. Whatever that meant. Earlier in the day, the typically sedate entertainer appeared amused as the 45-year-old accuser again took jurors step by step through his alleged attack. Cosby, his eyes closed, smiled as Constance said he'd touched her breasts penetrated her with his fingers and put her hand on his penis. In a cringeworthy moment earlier Monday, the cell phone of lead defense counsel Tom Mazur went off as he grilled Constant, drawing a menacing look from the judge, who orders that all phones be powered off in the courtroom. As Constant's two days of testimony wrapped, jurors saw phone records contradicting previous statements she'd made about calling Cosby the night of the assault. You told police you called him. Mazir said pointedly. I gave my best recollection of the evening, Constand replied. Cosby is charged with three counts of aggravated indecent assault for the alleged sex attack, and faces up to ten years behind bars on each count. The entertainer came under fire last year during his first trial by openly leering as Constand fully recounted, in graphic detail, her memory of the alleged assault. That trial ended when a jury was unable to return a verdict. 